650 voices harmonize your favorite holiday classics on stage at the Skirmerhorn Symphony Center. It's pretty incredible to be part of a performance of this caliber in general, to get to sing with the backing of hundreds of students and the orchestra and everything. Awesome. The Christmas at Belmont concert has been tradition at the school for many years and has been nationally televised since 2003. Different Belmont alum have hosted the event this year. The honor goes to Tricia Yearwood, who credits the school with her success. People ask me all the time, you know, how do you get in the music industry? And there's a million different ways, but this was my path, and it was, it was a good one. So I'm proud to come back and really happy to see these students. I can't even explain how cool it is to get to sing with Tricia. Like, the fact that that we walked in the hallway and she's standing there in the hallway talking to us about like what dorm she used to live in it was pretty cool. Yearwood says Christmas is her favorite holiday and spending the season singing with these students brings back welcomed memories. I was able to stop by the stage at Massey Performing Arts Center where numerous Belmont students first began their music careers including previous Christmas at Belmont hosts Josh Turner and Melinda Doolittle. Standing here, I can't help but wonder about the next wave of talent that will cross these boards and go on to enjoy successful careers. They too will be able to say, I received my start at Belmont University. It looks like the next performance is ready, so let's return to Christmas at Belmont. God rest ye merry gentlemen, let nothing you dismay. Remember Christ our Savior's born on Christmas Day To save us all from Satan's power when we were gone astray Oh, tidings of comfort and joy, comfort and joy Oh, tidings of comfort and joy. Primer Natus in Bethlehem, Alleluia. Unde gaudet Jerusalem. From God our Heavenly Father, a blessed angel came, and unto certain shepherds brought tidings of the same. God by name. Oh, tidings of comfort and joy. But when to Bethlehem they came, it was there.